Welcome back. Now, tonight on Your Story, we focus on 35-year-old Peter Onyango, a painter from Migori. Onyango, for the past year, has been using his painting workshops to rehabilitate young people recovering from drug use and drug addiction. Well, this story, The Painter, was suggested by his wife, Elsa Akinyi. For the painter, every canvas is like an open book to create something beautiful, either out of imagination, memory, or observation. Peter Onyango dips his paintbrush into his paint, whether oils or acrylics, and later begins with his brush to leave bold strokes on each canvas. In the end, his work is pure art. Painting, as Pablo Picasso, a famous painter once said, is just another way of keeping a diary. But for the 35-year-old who has been painting professionally for a year, painting is a way of saving the lives of young men and women who would otherwise have them destroyed by drug use and drug addiction. <laughs> This is your story. Peter's own personal portrait is one that doesn't reflect his present trade. In his childhood and teenage years, he knew that he always had an affinity for drawing and painting. In the 844 system, art and craft was a mandatory subject in primary school, but it was phased out in primary school in 2001. He was not able to train professionally and perfect his skill. I was a dog. At class 1, I was a dog, but I was a dog. But at class 8, I only joined secondary school. Onyango to survive became a rider. He worked with G4S for close to 13 years, but the call to artistry was constantly beating brightly in his chest. Currently, I was in one year. Peter noticed that Migori, his home county, is one in which many young people are vulnerable to drug-related vices, being one of the major drug trafficking gateways, particularly for Bang. According to police, 25% of the youth in Migori are drug addicts, 5% currently serving jail terms. He chose to train as many young people in his path to paint and eventually keep off drugs. He has so far trained 40. In a target, uh, my youth, when you wanna, wanna, wanna to me, the field is free for everyone na kama a girl child wenye wangependa ku join pia wako free ni for everyone so nikaacha mambo na boda boda kwa zilikuwa tayari some somehow na vitu zingine zenye nilikuwa nikifanya saa akaanza kunifundisha vile nilisha gain mimi pia niko na place yangu ambayo pia mimi anza kuchora ingawaje mimi ni mkazi wa Tanzania lakini inanibidi kwa sababu ya umaarufu wake wenye wako nao nilikuwa nataka hata mimi nifanye nini ni mkopi ndio hata mimi niwe nao ni utoe hapa Kenya na mimi ni upeleke pale Tanzania Painting is the silence of thought and the music of sight. Onyango aspires to be world-renowned like Pablo Picasso, who said every now and then, one paints a picture that seems to have opened a door and serves as a stepping stone to other things. His paintings are giving the young people he's training a new lease of life. Dorcas Wangira, Citizen TV, Your Story.